so the hip now is 36 inches half of 36 inches is 80 so you will use 18 for the front and 18 for the back so I have my 18 inches here I have to now either use my phone to google it okay or I will have to use the folding method now this is this one is easy because we know that 3 6 is 18 so this one is easy no fraction all right so this one is 6 okay we're going to fold it down to 12 and here we have our 18 inches okay three sixes is 18 so this one is easy as I said no fraction so that is it you will now fold this into okay the three inches here will represent the line here so the other three inches will be on the other side so we'll mark this okay right there and I have mine a little wider so that is how you get it I hope you're really understanding what I'm trying to say so you will mark this so you will now connect the waist to the hip all right so you connect the waist to the hip but you can also go on to the hemline and uh, you can have it as wide as you want but you can have it also very much narrow some people don't like um, white gore so this is it so this is the hemline here and this is what it's looking like and then you will add your half inch seam allowance to this half inch seam allowance and half inch seam allowance on the waist with the skirt most of the time the zipper goes in the side so we know that the zipper goes in the left left side to cut the other five so I have now three to the front and three to the back to the back just imagine that they're all here so now you have a complete score skirt you will have to add a half inch to each before you cut and this is for the allowance because if you don't it's going to tighten the skirt and here I have my half inch because it's folded okay you cut one side with the half inch it reflects on the other side now the side where the zipper is going and that is to the left side you want to give it a little bit more than half inch you want to give it three quarter of an inch or one inch and this will be to this piece underneath to the back and the front so that will be to the back piece to the left and the back piece so this is the left side you know you'll have the back there okay so these two pieces requires about three quarter of an inch or one inch for the zipper okay what if you don't want the zipper here but you want the zipper in the center back so this would be the center back so the piece you want your zipper in the center back that means this piece you will have to give it one inch allowance to accommodate the zipper okay and then you can cut it in two pieces all right just want to show you so it will be one inch for the zipper there it is without the one inch it lines up with this okay but now you add your one inch for the zipper it's going to go wider so it will be at the back and it will be like this you will place your 8 inch zipper from here to here okay so that will be the back piece there 
don't want to bother to open it up all right so that is how you make a six gore so um you might be wondering how much it's going to take you how much fabric it's going to take you to cut this skirt now if you cut in the skirt on the bias it's going to take you far more but um, for a skirt like this, even if you have a 48 inches hip, um, this one yard of 60 inches fabric can cut the skirt. Um, it also depends on how wide you're making it, okay? And when you're cutting it, when you place it on the fabric, you come to the top of the fabric, and this is how you place it. So you don't place them all like this to cut them. All right, you want to turn the middle one up. So this is how you would do it. All right. And so with the allowance and everything, you're able to cut each piece. And remember, um, you would double the fabric. So you have three to the front and three to the back. So this doesn't take a lot of fabric when you do it this way. Okay, you can actually use one yard of fabric to do it. I've also done a little sample here. I've sewn it for you, especially for the beginners who might have a challenge wondering how do I assemble this garment? How do I sew it? So I told you about adding one inch to the side, to the left side for the zipper. So I did that. Okay. And the other three pieces here. I've just joined it so I'm showing you how to join it okay so that is your skirt and this is the front and the other part the other three would be to the back and um, when you're through with it you can center it like this center it like this and this is when you give it that little curve Take off that little half inch here to the edge. So that is how you do it. So it's not sticking out. And you also want to take off a little half inch here to the top here. And taper it off like that. So this is what your finished skirt should be looking like. All right, something more like that. So thank you for watching and please remember to like, share and subscribe. And this is part one. This is part two of the video. So happy sewing. Thank you.